This motherfucker would fucking get them drunk way before the show even started filming. And encourage them to get drunk. It was like fucking... It was like fucking 8 in the morning. This motherfucker's like, Champagne, everybody! He's giving them all champagne. They're all getting drunk. Let's start filming once they're fucking shit-faced. And then the black women start fighting with the white women. And that's the kind of shit that this guy filmed. And she's saying he to he made this toxic environment on purpose for all of us. And some of us were alcoholics. I hadn't been drinking for nine months. And I got on this show and he turned me fucking, you know, I started fucking all these guys because I was drunk. And my husband got mad and divorced me. So she's all mad and shit. And she's suing him now. All right. She's also claiming this guy would walk around with cocaine. And all the assistants and everyone in the crew to the cameraman just pouring it out. Everybody, you want a line? Here you go. Put your hands out. <laughs> And he, you want some too? All right. And he'd give everybody. And the, and the girls from the show who would do cocaine with him would get more screen time. She says, I didn't do cocaine. I'm skinny because I work out and I have a, a good diet. But I never did cocaine like they did, she says. But the girls who did cocaine with him, they got more screen time because they were his little cocaine buddies. And so now she's trying to sue the shit out of him uh, because of this. Um, um, yeah, I don't doubt it, you know, but this, this chick is a, f <laughs> this chick is a hypocrite because she indulged in all these activities and now she wants to sue because what? You're not a movie star. You run out of money. Your husband divorced you or whatever the fuck. Fuck you. If you took part in it, then you knew what you were doing. Hey, I hate fucking lawsuits like this. I hate celebrities like this. Oh, I was I was drunk and then I was I used to be an alcoholic and then they brought the dark side out of me again. No fuck you. You know exactly if you're an alcoholic and you've been sober for nine months, you know exactly what you're doing when you take that beer and someone gives it to you. If you've been sober for my mom nine months and someone says you want a beer and you say sure, you want to get drunk. Fuck you. You've been miserable those nine months and you want to have some fun. You know exactly what you're doing. Fuck her. I, I'm with Andy Cohen here. It's probably true. I'm not going to lie. This is the real housewives. I mean, I probably watched like half an episode and I could tell those bitches were either on drugs or drunk. I mean, they're rich as fuck. I would too. If I was a woman and my husband was rich as fuck and I stayed home all day, I'd be drunk and on drugs all day long and I'd have all my friends over and we'd be over here just fighting and being bitches. That's how it would be. And that's just me. So goddamn well, this is what's going on. And she partook in it. Fuck her for trying to, you know, fucking say, oh, oh, you know, they fucking did this to me. You fucking knew what you were doing when you signed up for the fucking show. You dumb bitch. Cheers to fucking Andy Cohen. I like this motherfucking guy. All right. You can do your cocaine and feed these women alcohol. As long as you don't rape them, there's nothing wrong with that. All right. Don't do what Diddy does. All right. There's nothing wrong with getting women all loaded up so they can have fun. Girls just want to have fun. Hey, if you like this kind of content, how about giving this a like and a subscribe? And if you want to watch the full show, click on the link on the right or check the description.